郭文贵在云中洗锅遭受司法四面围剿，个个朝不保夕，但还是要打肿脸充胖子，找些洋面孔站台。一些不要脸的美国的自媒体人，只要给钱就能帮你吹捧一下。瞧瞧这口号，我们都是郭文贵。蚂蚁们其实也心虚，会觉得把自己当做小郭文贵的话，也有可能会坐牢的。观众朋友们，大家好，欢迎收看新中国联邦新闻。我们是消灭邪恶中国共产党的新中国人。今天是二零二三年十月九日，星期一，现在是美东时间早上八点半。我是周哲，我是 Amy。十月七日，新中国联邦记者罗伊参加维恩杜普里节目，节目主持人感慨地谈到：“通过和新中国联邦人的交流，我了解到中国人正在遭受的。”苦难和贫困，并知道了，如果不跟中共马上脱钩，在中共国发生的事都会发生在美国。如果没有新中国联邦人，我们对中共想要对美国做的事将一无所知。我迫不及待地希望郭文贵先生能够早日获得自由。你们每个人都是郭文贵，请看报道。中新中国联邦人都是郭文贵。What's your feeling, or what's the difference you feel between, you know, the Chinese people you've been contacting, you've been working with, and the Chinese people in the CCP's propaganda or in the legacy, like media? Talking with y'all and learning so much from you, I look at headlines a whole lot differently now too. I look at the stories that they put out. I really don't hang too much with the regular U.S. media now. Most of my stuff I look outside the United States because we're too sheltered, pampered, or、well, not pampered. I'm relied to so much here that we can't get the truth. So when you told me, when Avery and you told me about how many of the Chinese people are suffering on a monthly basis, the poverty that's going on over there, I would have never thought. I not in a million years would I have ever thought that that was happening. Now I have seen a few documentaries, right? I've seen like big high risers, right? And I've seen people live in very small spaces. But I thought that China or the Chinese people, because of my ignorance, I thought that the Chinese people were living beautifully. When you're looking at all that glitzy glamour and lights, I mean, it really puts on a facade about what's really going on. And that's probably what the CCP is meant to do. You see all the lights, you see all this, and see, see all that, and oh, tourism, yeah, let's go over there, let's spend our money and stuff, man. But to learn that so many people are dying, living in poverty, you showed one time the the mudslides and stuff, and cars being taken away with the water,、um, the infrastructure type of stuff and everything. It's like Chinese people need help. They need help. They can't go into a church. And pray to God or pray to their Creator without seeing Xi's photo. That's crazy. It's ridiculous. It's shameful. To tell you the truth, the correlation that happens over in China, y'all tell us or y'all been telling us. Did you see what happened in the United States? There, what happened in China is happening over here. And if y'all don't hurry up and decouple, everything that you see now will be totally in the United States of America. So that's some of the messages that. We get from talking with you and the group. How important is the intel from the NFSC that we continue to reviewing the, the these type of information to the public? Without you, we wouldn't know anything. That's why me, Hutch, and Jay try to give y'all as much praise as we can, and even that's not enough because without you, we wouldn't know anything. We would still be lost in the wilderness on what the CCP is trying to do to this country. And I know that y'all appear on other networks and stuff like that, but our audience really understands exactly what's going on, and they share. They share it. It's not just a TV spot to them. When y'all come on, y'all are part of the family, or, or at least that's what we've tried to create is like that family connection. So when y'all come on and y'all start talking, and it's like, okay, family member has just come on, they're updating us about what we need to go out and share with other people. Without that knowledge, I don't know where we would be right now. Seriously, I really don't. Like、um, I've been thinking, she is coming to the United States at the end of the month. Now, maybe six or seven months ago, I wouldn't care, but now I'm like. What's behind it? That makes me tell my audience, and then she's coming over here at the end of the month. We don't know what's going on, but we're telling you so that you keep your eyes on it. 
So if anything pops off, then you understand you heard it here on the Wayne Dupree show because we are watching all of it now. We're watching every bit of it. We aren't trying to hide anything from you. We aren't trying to interpret something for you. We want you to see exactly what's going on. And then you can go out and do your own research from that point on. Without y'all, man, we would know that the Chinese companies were trying to buy land in the United States of America. We wouldn't know that they were spending $17 million dollars within the American educational system to teach young kids about the CCP. We wouldn't know that. And I mean, again, Miles, man, I can't wait till he get out because if he doesn't hug each and every one of y'all, because he has to be proud of y'all. He has to be proud of y'all because Papa's not here, but the children are doing exactly what they need to be doing. I mean, I know I would be proud of you. I'm serious. I I mean, if something happened to me and I had a group like y'all, basically y'all are Miles. That's how I look at y'all. You are, see, my country's coming out. You are miles. I wish I had a group like y'all. I'm, I'm serious. Because I know at least if I wouldn't hear that everybody that listened to y'all would hear me. And it's the same way. When y'all speak, when y'all whistle blow, when y'all explain things, you hear miles in there. We'll see you next time.